Well, Jackie, as you know, this is the second time in less than two years that Father Michael Flager has faced sexual abuse allegations involving a young person. The Southside activist priest was cleared of wrongdoing last year, but now he faces a new allegation this time from the member of a children's choir back in the 1980s. Angry, mad, frustrated. The St. Sabina Faith Community. We are reliving another nightmare again. In utter shock. It hurt me tremendously. I was devastated. The Archdiocese of Chicago's Office for Child Abuse Investigations reporting the new allegation to the Illinois Department of Children and Family Services. Thank you for your prayers. In a letter to the St. Sabina Faith Community, Father Michael Flager saying, quote, on Friday, I was informed by the Archdiocese that the same lawyer whose clients made unfounded allegations of misconduct against me last year has found a new client to make different allegations against me. I'm going to fight harder. Flager at an undisclosed location this evening, separated from his flock, pending the results of the investigation. The alleged victim said to be in his late 40s, accusing the 73-year-old activist priest of sexually abusing him at St. Sabina decades ago. In a written statement, Cardinal Blaise Supich saying, quote, the abuse is alleged to have occurred more than 30 years ago. In keeping with our child protection policies, Father Flager has been asked to step aside from ministry and live away from the parish while the allegation is investigated. Flager agreeing to cooperate fully with the investigation. It's not laughable, you know what I mean, but it kind of is. At St. Sabina in Chicago's Auburn Gresham neighborhood, Joseph Saunders, who works with parish youth, outraged over the allegations, which he's convinced are false. After so many years, at this point in time, you want to come back and, you know, say, make these false allegations. It's the same thing over again. In the written statement, Father Flager saying, quote, while I am confident that the new allegation will also be determined to be unfounded, this process is so unfair and painful to me and to the community I serve. I don't trust nobody nearly with my child. Erica Nanton says she works with abuse victims. And I can tell you, Father Mike has never, ever, ever exhibited anything now, a spokesperson for Eugene Hollinger. He is the lawyer representing the latest alleged victim and the two previous accusers making serious allegations tonight. A fourth man submitted an affidavit, Flager touching his genitals over his clothes when he was 18, but did not file a claim. A serious allegation. We reached out to Father Flager for comment. No word yet from the 73-year-old priest. At St. Sabina, Julian Cruz, WGN News.